Greetings traders. A lot of you have been asking how to set up your software like I've got mine set up. Uh, setting up the charts like I've got mine set up and um, all my settings and everything. And there is an easy way for me to do this for you to help you. And what it is, is, um, let's see here. What I've done is I've gone here to file and I've gone to workspaces and save as and I've saved my workspace as a file which is an XL XML file and then all you need to do actually I went here I went to file global settings and save as so I've saved my global settings as a certain file and I've called it David setup all you need to do is go in here to this global settings and load that file. So here is the file. Actually, you can't see it. Um, it's just a little XML file and it's called David Setup. It's on another screen right now. And what I'm going to do is offer this file to you on the website. You'll see it that you can download my settings for the um, well, th th this software is called many different names. It's called Apex Trader through Apex Futures. It's called Global Zen Trader through Global Futures. There's actually other brokers that also have the same software. I don't know their names, but other people have shown them to me over the over the over the years. You know, over the last couple of years or last year or so. And I believe that you can use this file for all of them, if I'm not mistaken. And all you got to do is just take this file and go here to File, Global Settings, and Load. And then it, when you do this, let's go ahead and do it right now. When you do this, you'll just go to wherever the file is, select on it, and then load it. Load that file into here, and all of a sudden when you do that, all of a sudden it's going to come up with all my settings. You'll see my charts. You'll see, you'll see I've got the 10 minute setup, I've got a daily setup, I've got a 1 minute setup. It'll look just like mine, it'll be white, it'll have the candlesticks just like mine. Um, also, everything else will be set up just like mine. For instance, on your stops will be set at market, so they're not set at limit. Never get yourself into trouble. Um, everything like that will be set up just like mine. So, I think that'll help a lot of you to get started for those of you who are new and or you just want to have it exactly like mine and make it easy on yourself because when you load it for the first time and you don't have it set up it loads it a bit weird there's all kinds of weird stuff on it that I don't like you probably won't like it either and it won't look like mine so it might confuse you a little bit so this file will definitely help you just look on the website you'll see it under the watch pages I'll put it there under the code 1 code 2 watch pages I'll also put it on the main page right up front for a while to allow everybody to see it and download it. If you run into trouble where it comes up and it's blank, just go to work to workspaces and choose restore default workspace and it will come back up like it normally does and then try to load it again. And it should work. If not, you can ask the broker for some help and see if they can help you. But um, just keep trying it a few times, and it should work. Once it comes up, you'll know because it'll look just like mine. It'll look like, you know, it'll have my my uh, charts. It'll look like this and everything. So, and it have the one minute, the ten minute, and the daily. Now I've got four different screens that this is working off of, but you'll be able to bring it, it'll show up in the bottom, you'll be able to bring it up no problem and set it up the way you want. I do recommend that you use two screens when you trade. Uh, one screen, like for instance, this is one screen. Where are you going to put your charts at now? And you can put them right here. You can put two charts right here, one right here and one right here, or just even just one chart. Just have a one minute chart. So you can do it with one screen. But two screens certainly does help. I've got four on this particular computer. It's pretty much overkill. Uh, you don't need four screens to trade the futures. With stocks, you do. With stocks, you could use eight screens. But with the futures, you don't need it. Two screens is fine. So anyway, I hope the file will help you. 
I know it'll help a lot of you newbies out there want to get started you have a little trouble setting everything up don't know how to do it properly just use that file I'm gonna to give to you okay it'll be on the watch pages and on the main page take care happy trading